What is up, rockers? Welcome back here to another Rise of Kingdoms content. In this video, we're going to tackle the question of how do we transfer resources in Cross Kingdom, right? So I am in Kingdom 1382. How do I transfer my resources to the next kingdom that I am going to? In this video, I'm going to show it to you. Wow, this is, oh my God, ah oh man. All these movements of transferring resources, it's really getting, you know, getting really exhausting right now. Guys, stop me from doing this. I might have some carpal tunnel. Ah, wow, it's so hard right now. <laughs> um, so I am right now transferring my resources to my farm account. All right, so this is going to my farm account. Well, this was my old account, my, you know, alt account. And as you can see, I had over 800 million stones in my current main account, 77 million foods, 44.6 million wood, and 116 million gold. I'm going to try to transfer all of these resources back to me. Well, some of them are going to be lost through taxes, but I'm going to move all these resources back to me when I go to the next kingdom that I am going to. Now, here's the question. Do you guys already have a clue or have an idea how I am going to be doing this? Leave it down in the comment section below if you already know what the plan is. Let me know because I'm curious who can actually figure it out. Now, I want to do a quick shout out to Puddle Cakes for giving me this idea because he was like, oh, you're going to be migrating. Um, are you thinking about your resources? How is it going to go? But here's an idea. So the entire thing in here, you know, was a given idea from Puddle Cakes. So if you guys don't know who the, who Puddle Cakes is, he is a YouTuber as well. He is starting out. Um, so if you guys would like to go to his channel and support him over there, subscribe to him, say hi to him. And we're also um, going to see another YouTuber in here who is actually going to help us out as well. So um, as we go through the video, I'll introduce him to uh to you guys now if you guys are new to the channel maybe you guys haven't created a youtube account yet you've been watching our channel guys consider creating an, an account in youtube sign in and subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell icon or notification and get that bell icon and get notified so that whenever we upload the videos for rise of kingdoms or other videos you guys would get notified and um, watch some of our amazing content let's support the channel guys so um, smash that thumbs up as well for analytics, guys. Let's go. Let's do it. I know we can. I am very passionate about this game. I love this game. And I am here wanting to help you guys to succeed with me in Rise of Kingdom. So if you want to succeed, consider subscribing. So as you can see, we're transferring majority of our resources already into the alt account. We've already finished transferring the stone. We're transferring a little bit of the gold. We're transferring some of uh you know with, with the food as well but i'm leaving still some in here just in case if i need to use it um and then the rest will probably be given away to some of the members in the server it's a bittersweet that i'm going to be leaving pretty soon um i'm not sure when is the exact date when the migration is going to happen but you're gonna have an idea also where i am going to go so if you guys haven't figured it out yet well it's relatively uh, relatively easy to figure out from this video so um, continuously trying to transfer everything in here and then I'm gonna go and switch into my account now and I'm going to go into my alt account here we go so what I have done now since now I'm in the alt account I used my alt account um, after I've transferred all these resources I went into Lost Kingdom and I made contact to the player who is going to be transferring the resources to me so we've been invited, right, uh, by Tekka Gaming. We've been invited, getting getting invited, you know, by other players from, uh, from this from fourteen twelve Kingdom as well. So I've I've messaged Tekka Gaming. So if you have a friend in your server that you're gonna go into, and you can say, hey, um, I want to bring my resources, and we're in the same KVK. Um, let's do what Shinchi did. Um, let's check this video out, and um, let's see how he did it. So basically. Um, what I did is like, like, as you can see, we mig uh, we not migrate, we we teleported into the Lost Kingdom. We brought out five marches, or well, I guess four marches out. So whenever he attacks my city, he's not attacking anything, right? So he attacks my city, he loots everything, 
and then he's just getting my resources, right? There's a little bit of a tax loss, a little bit, but it's not much. Um, it's still better than nothing, right? So I want to do a quick shout out because this is the second YouTuber that is, uh, you know, helping us out here in this video. Um, you know, Tekka Gaming is a Arabic YouTuber. So majority of his viewers are from, uh, you know, Arabic community. But it would be really awesome if some of our English community, um, English speaking community, Asian community would show love to our um, Arabic, um, you know, Rise of Kingdoms YouTuber. It's amazing. He's helping me out. Um, we've, we've talked such a wonderful person and just such a loving person because he is just so like, um, what is that called? So warm, uh, like open armed, you know, the, the Arabic community is just wonderful. Their, 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 um, their hospitality is just like so nice. They're super nice people. They're very caring community. I love it. I love it. And that's what really attracted me to, to this kingdom because they're very respectful and even though they're very powerful, they're they can they can crush the enemy easily. They're not like super like cocky compared to like other kingdoms. Um, but really, the Arabic community and there's actually a bunch of like international players um, in in the um, in the server as well. So I've become friends recently with uh, Little Jerkania and uh, you know wonderful person. Um, and you know the person is living in Asia, actually not um, Arabic, but you know I'm saying, but basically what I'm saying is like there's a little bit of a differences of culture in the server as well, and of course dollar, and of course, of course I cannot forget my favorite person there, um, Oslimo. So if you guys, uh, Oz, Miss Oslim, so if you guys hear this, send her a message, say that I, I mentioned her name, okay, just just so she doesn't get upset with me. <laughs> so. Um, basically, the general idea of this is that uh, transfer your resources to your farm or alt account, and then you can only do this if you're fighting the kingdom in Lost Kingdom um, that you're going to be migrating into. Since we're going to be trying to get into the uh, 1412, um, well, it's pretty obvious now where we're going to go, right? Um, you can only do this in that situation. So put your resources in your alt, go to Lost Kingdom. And have your friend um, raid your um, alt account or farm account. And then once you migrate into the kingdom, your designated kingdom, and then he can transfer the resources back to you. Now, they're considering there might be some losses in there. You might not get everything, you know, through the transportation and true to attacking. So you might get a fair share of amount still. Maybe you might want to reward the player who is going to be doing all the work in here. I mean, he's doing all the work in here. I'm attacking my um my uh my my city um to get all these resources. So it's a lot of work to do it. So you know maybe give him like maybe ten twenty percent of resources if you if you'd like. Um, I did offer Tekka Gaming. I said, hey, you can you know take some of my resources as well. But he said no because I mean like let's be honest, I got a crap ton of resources like insane. Um, I know some of you guys already know that I like I hoard a lot of resources, <laughs> but there's that. You know, this is amazing. So make sure that you put out your troops outside as well, so you don't um, get you know you know him to attack your city or her attack your city, because then there's just going to be a lot of casualty that way, and it's really not worth it to do it that way. So make sure you bring all your troops out because, like I said, just you know less problem for that. So this technique, I'm not sure if it's being utilized by many players, because when I used to migrate before, I would migrate. Um, and that would just transfer all my resources, right, to the players who are in the kingdom. But I have never migrated yet to the enemy uh, in the KVK or allies in the KVK. So this is the first time that I'm doing it. And this is a great new way. I know this thing happens a lot. Like, I know there's a lot of players that go and migrate to the kingdom that they fought with or their allies with. So this is something that you can definitely do, right? Move your resources. And, um, hey, guys, don't tell Lilith about this because this is like breaking the game. Like, this is like hacking the game. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. Just keep kidding on the Lilith part. I'm sure they don't care about it. Uh, but it, it's a good loophole um, to move your resources because I don't know how many people are doing this. I think it's absolutely insane. And, um, wow, look at this. Uh, more marches from... Uh, from Tekka Gaming, you know, it's 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 a, it's a, it's a hassle really. Five marches looting and you can see my stone is um 
four hundred million right now is going down quick, which is pretty good. And I'm um, just sitting here waiting, um, watching it get burned and get, get looted. It's actually quite satisfying as well. At the same time, um, in a peaceful way, as you can see. You know, one thing I love about this game is that you really meet amazing people. Like, if you guys have somebody that you guys want to make a shout out to, you know, considering you guys have watched this far into the video, I'd say leave their name, tag them out, you know, tag them in the name. Uh, ta I don't think you can tag in, in, in here, but you can share this video on Facebook or whatever and tag them and um, or tag them into your Discord, share the video, tag them on Discord or just leave their name in the comment section below. And why do you want to give a shout out to this person? Like what's so special about this person that you want to go all the way out and to make a shout out? So amazing, right? Wonderful game, wonderful community. And um, I, I'm really happy that, you know, he is helping us out in here and you know i'll have resources once i join their kingdom and i won't be like super drained on resources so i'll have a good amount of stones i probably won't have to farm stones for a while i i, I really hope that everything will turn out great though because i know there's so many people going to 14 12 i think i've heard like over a hundred or something that are going to try to migrate I'm not sure how they're going to do it because they're already on Imperium Kingdom. So they might be like trying to like delete some some troops, maybe remove some siege, lower the power. I'm not quite sure how they're going to do it. But I just know that it's going to be very exciting because there's a lot of big name players who are going to be going to 1412. Um, now, it's a coincidence that Baba is actually going to 1412 as well. Um 1412 invited me before this KVK. It's funny enough, Dollar sent me an invite asking me uh, if I would be, uh, if I would like to migrate to 1412, which I declined. And then, funny enough, coincidentally, we match in KVK, which is, you know, it's, not, it's, it's, it's like Lilith's been listening to our conversation on Discord. But, so. There's that, right? We end up, you know, matching up in here. And uh, me and Tekka Gaming, throughout this journey in here, he have reached out and we've talked. Um, I've, you know, been to his stream and he's just such a wonderful player. Great guy to talk to. We had a good collaboration. I think you guys have watched a collaboration. If you haven't watched a collaboration with me and Tekka Gaming, so I titled it as low spender. Uh, sorry, actually, I titled it as a, uh, a spender versus low spender. It gives you the idea of what it's like to be in a very super strong kingdom compared to where I am. Uh, we, you know, we're not like extremely strong, but we're strong. But compared to 1412 or nothing, and, you know, in my opinion, I mean, you know, 1382 might not like what I said, but we know that how active 1412 is strong and strong they are. But basically, I'm saying is that if you're a player, in, you know, not not a huge spender in a very strong kingdom, you can do some serious damage. And he is low spender, and he's VIP uh, 17. And um, it just shows you how much chess he gets daily being in that alliance. And, 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 and you know what's amazing is that they love him as well, and they respect him. So it's it's amazing to be in a kingdom that loves you and respect you. And um, hopefully, as we go into a new journey in here, that I would be able to make some new Habibis, and, you know, make new friends, and um, just have fun, you know, perhaps, you know, talk, you know, to them on Discord. And and I think it's going to be very interesting. I'm super excited. I mean, I know there's going to be a lot of, like, language barrier because 1412 is predominantly a rabbit community. So I might have to learn some Arabic words from Tech Gaming. Um, I have to learn some get down, get down, get down Arabic words. Very, very much. Now, does that make sense? I, I always hear him say get down, get down, get down. I think it means very, very much. Oh, no. Somebody teleported. Um, no, no, no. Let me move my troops. Let me move it quick, 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 quick. Oh, okay. There we go. It's moving. Um, oh, no. What the heck is he doing? Is he gonna raid? Okay, we're gonna bring back the troops. 
my god bunch of seeds trying to loot off from me how much did he loot over t t t 15 million ish 15 million ish resources oh my goodness ah this guy piggybacked on me huh just all my resources in here well we got to bring our troops there and i'm gonna send him a message and like hey come on man we're just transferring resources han young was say yo Man, why is this Hanyoung as they all trying to lube me, man? Man. All right, Tekka Gaming is back at it again. Back at it again with the red troops. Tekka Gaming, back at it again. There we go. So, I mean, you know, after this, after I messaged him, I don't know if he saw it or not. He didn't really, you know, he didn't really reply to me. But I think he understood what the heck is going on in here. That we're, like, trying to get looted and transfer resources. So, what do you guys think about this strategy, though? What do you think? Is, is it dope strategy? Would you guys actually do this strategy? And if you like the strategy, let me know in the comment section below. And, of course, press that like button if you like the strategy. And um, share this video because it's such an easy strategy to follow. And um, maybe some of the players probably don't understand how to do it. Just share this video to them and they'll, you know, figure it out relatively easy. It's really not that difficult. It takes a little bit of time and really coordination with the player. But like I said, find a good player, somebody that you trust. I completely trust Tekka Gaming that when I go into that, um, you know, 1412, that he'll give the resources back to me. So trust is a big thing. And that's a key thing in this type of game. So, guys, um, wonderful video today to share to you guys. Wonderful knowledge. I want to, again, say thank you to Puddle Cakes and thank you to Tekka Gaming. And, of course, thank you to all the supporters uh, that are following this channel that are continuously watching daily contents for our channel. Whether if it's Rise of Kingdoms, whether if it's reaction video, whether if it's random videos that I'm uploading or a vlog. I just want to say, guys, thank you because you guys are the best. I know I'm not like the number one YouTuber here for this genre. But hell, I appreciate every single one of you guys because you guys are awesome. And I'm super happy to have you guys watching us, following us. And I hope you guys will continue to do so. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you again next time.